so we're gonna make one for my friend who's visiting me today i haven't seen her in years so this is exciting this is oh which you pick your color i have these are made in the usa so these are gold plated or brass oxide she said gold we do need two holes in here so i'm going to show you how to punch a hole how to curve it and put it on a color So now this is a nylon plier. You see how it's curved? Mm -hmm. You're going to take this and you're going to squeeze your feather so it curves like mine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so mm -hmm. go ahead. Mm -hmm. Give that a shot. I just punched a hole with a twist punch. Super easy. You just keep turning it and turning it. And this piece right here in the middle punctures the metal and made mm -hmm. a hole. Mm -hmm. And now she's curving mm -hmm. it so it goes around your wrist. I think that works. Curling it. So we are almost, yeah, we're almost done with the project. <laughs> we're going to string it on the piece. So what I found was I had a hard time wrapping this around. You, yep, you see that? Wrapping it around and it kept doing that. Mm -hmm. So I did an overhand knot at the end with a tiny tail. Then I string this through. This has been my brace that I've been wearing for three weeks now. You can wash this silk. It's hand dyed, handmade in the USA. It's made out of clothing weight silk, you guys. I love it. We have a trunk show of these now. Okay, so you tighten it by pulling against the loop. Then I wrap it once, twice, once on the back side. Then I come around and I just tuck this in two times. And that is all you're gonna do. So we have a red and black silk. Ooh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So let's see, which side did I put the knot in? I put it in the, the base. Okay. Would you like to make it so you can see oh, you made no. something else no. while you're here? I trust you. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna pull that through. And then I'm gonna tie an overhand knot. And welcome everybody who's hanging out with us on YouTube. And if this is in replay, I hope you're enjoying this project. If you need any supplies, let us know. Or, you know, dig around in your bead box. Now you can be like, I never knew what to do with that one piece of silk that I had. Alrighty. Oh, look, I did it. I did it didn't incorrectly. Not. I didn't give you the loop. <laughs> I was like, this one looks different than mine. Okay. So that would be if, if you just wanted to make it stick. Now, how did I make a loop at the end? I remember. Okay. I did it this way. Okay. Come down. And then up. There we go. All right. And then there's just a loop over here. I know. You'd think that I wasn't beating every single day. <laughs> or you do. Because there's so much information rushing through my brain that I want to share with as many people as possible. I'm always like, wait. Okay. So, this is going to come through like so. And you, it will soften so you can just give it a little bit of slack so it doesn't pull too hard against your wrist. And try that. And then you can snug it as much as you want. Wrap, wrap. I did twice in one side and once on the other because there's enough for three times. If you can stick your wrist under there so everyone can see. And that is how I use color to wear whatever it is I'm wearing every day to represent, you know, or balance out something that I, an extra thing that I need.